All right, ladies and gentlemen, y'all already know what time it is, man. If you like the video, like the video, subscribe for more daily 2K content, and let's get right into it. NBA 2K22, a lot of information, a little bit of time to get to it in, man. So we're not going to waste any time. But I do have to ask you this. If you don't do nothing else, make sure y'all like the video, man, because if you like the video, it helps us get closer, closer, closer to that oh-so-coveted 100K. It's been a long time. I'm trying to get there, trying to pursue this dream. And like I said, without further ado, let's just get right into the video, man. Pursuing the dream is what we starting off, man. And your boy, Bear the Beast, says it right here. I'm going to bust my to give myself a shot. If I fail, I fail. But I will never quit. When you quit, the dream is over. And that's something that's real, man. My dad told me that. My grandmama said, you, if you give up, you, you might you might, you might, might give out, but don't never give up. Pursue your dream as long as you got a means to get there. If you can, if you got a path, you got a dream, and you got a clear path to get there, then you, you, you still got a shot. If you don't have a clear path to get there, see if you can go sit down and look for a clear path to get there. And if you don't have a clear path, then maybe you got to take an unclear path. Every path ain't going to be clear. Some paths going to have rocks on it and stuff like that, man. It is what it is. So see if you find, if it ain't a clear path, see if you can find a mean to clear those rocks and do whatever you got to do, man. But you can get there. If you got a dream, you can make it. Just make sure you got a means to get there and don't be, you know, to your own detriment. That's it, man. That's all I got to say about that. But we just going to keep on moving on. Rivalry day. The Beast of the East won. Uh, I think we had like one by like five, six hundred points. It was real close with the Knights. Not going to lie to y'all. I thought it was going to be a little, a little bit more of a landslide victory, but it wasn't. And like I'm, I'm saying, though, a lot of people would want to say the Beast of the East, the best, blah, 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 this and that. Hey, listen, we won the rivalry day. But I ain't a lot of y'all, man. I've played in all the parks, and I'm telling you, it's comp in all parks. Like, Beast of the East, people like, want to be like, you know, Beast of the East just beat up on each other all the time, and then when we go play, we're just going to slaughter everybody. But that's not the case, because I've played in every park, and when I'm telling you that there's comp in every single park on 2K, ain't no one park better than the next. You know, it just is what it is. We all good players. Every park's got good players. Every park got bad players. But one thing I can tell you, it tell you is this. Right now, Beast of the East on top, one rival day. I don't know what we get. I haven't been to the park yet. I haven't looked at any of that stuff. But uh, when I get a chance, y'all let me know what it is. My boy T. Mizzle, man. Y'all let me know if anybody's having this issue right here. PlayStation ain't been out a year. And I'm already on my fourth controller. Now, my boy T. Miz, T. Uh, T. Mizzle, T. Mizzle, all that stuff right there. And then somebody asked, was it stick drift? Uh, was the stick drift this bad on PS4? And it was, I don't think so. Now, I'm not going to lie to you. I got a PS4 controller right here. I got a scuff vanish. I've had this controller for like two or three years. Never really had any issues out of it. The first one, uh, the button went bad or something like that. But other than that, I never really had any issues out of it. And I'm pretty sure that the PS4 controllers did not fail at this rate. But I'm seeing a lot of people saying that they're getting a lot of stick drift uh, from these controllers, from the newer, uh, from the PS5 controllers. I don't know if that's true. I don't have a PS5 yet. I will be getting it soon. Y'all confirm or deny that for me down in the comment section. Or is he just playing too much guard? Is he... Is, is he hitting them with too much with that left right or whatever, man? Y'all let me know down in the comment section what y'all think, man. Your boy, Power DF up next. I don't understand comments like this. What's up with people with terrible, I mean, people that's terrible at the game thinking that you have to skip showers or do nothing at all to achieve basic milestones in the game? And somebody sent him a message. It's pretty much saying, uh, well, it, that's in my, it's, that, yeah, mystical spell with a K. Y'all let me know if y'all catch that, man. That's the M-Y-S-T-I code, Miss Man, right here. Yeah. But anyway, sometimes I wonder how many showers did 99 overalls miss uh, to become 99 overalls. And, like, I, I really don't even understand that either because y'all know I work more than anybody. I, I, I work at home. I probably work 10, 10, 12 hours a day minimum. I get on stream, play with Brute two or three hours a day. I literally am the casual guy's casual guy. I play three or four hours a day, and that's it. Now, Brute and Gambit, they be out there sweating. Boy. Now, they ain't, they ain't lie. They, they be out there sweating. When I'm talking about sweating, they be out there sweating, sweating. Like, like they, they got a lot of games. My boy Anonymous got 2,700. It doesn't take much to get to 99, man. You just got to play well in the games, and you got to... um. I think I got down like maybe 100 games, maybe 200 games, something like that. And there's also a thing called my career. I can see if you're talking about level 40 or something like that. That may have some validity. But a 99, bro, at this point in the game, what we like, we a month and a half in the into the game almost. If you ain't a 99 yet, you, you, you probably haven't even been trying or you might have a lot to do. Is there anybody out there that's not a 99 yet? I don't know, man. Y'all let me know. I think that everybody 
if you're on your first bill or you only had one bill, I feel like you should be on 99 by now, but you know, it is what it is. Uh, up next, hey, Quavo Quavo said, I'm about to start spamming two moves on this game. That's all you need. Now, I want y'all to let me know, do y'all think that it just being the left right do y'all think that, that we should attribute the left right being the dominant move in this game to to mike and the guys not putting out the all the dribble moves at once or do you think we were inevitably going to go this way because every single 2k goes this way you know eventually y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section if we had more moves if there were more dribble moves do you think people would be using left right and do you think that people are going to use more dribble moves once they unlock the dribble moves uh, in four days because we should have the new season coming this weekend. Y'all let me know. I don't know. I think people would have just figured out that just like last year that you only need two moves to curry slide or whatever and then they would have done that. So it is what it is. Your boy Brutal Sam caught cheating. Go watch the video. I ain't telling you. I ain't telling you about the video. You got to go over there and watch it, man. Nobody's perfect. That's a damn lie. Okay, so look, let me tell y'all something. He put this right here nobody is perfect i'm sorry if you think he believes for one second that he ain't perfect bro not 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 perfect in the sense of jesus perfect we ain't talking about that we're talking about if you think that he ain't got the biggest ego on the planet chat bruh bruh the, the, if there's one person that you know what i ain't even gonna say that man go watch the video you'll see what i'm talking about man that's my guy though man love that dude man it's one of the one of the guys big best guys in the community your boy laker fan says we can acknowledge that 2K16 and 17 were still good, but but you're out of your mind to sit here and call 2K22 a more arcadey game uh, than them when they both had part cards. Hey, listen, man, then he gonna double down on that thing. The same people sitting here, the same people on 2K22 for being too arcadey are the MFs who, who have uh, 2K15 and 16 uh, at the top of the all time. Then he tripled down. Your boy say he all not on triple down. And he said, listen, man, my list is uh, 17, 20, 22, 16, 15, 19, 21, 21, current gen, and 18. A lot of people are gonna agree with that. Some people might not agree with that, man. Um, I think it's a fair and valid argument. I mean, let me know what y'all top 2Ks now are down there. But I do feel like that the game is not as arcadey as people think it is. I think that this game is actually pretty damn tough. And uh, I think it's actually a pretty good game. And last but not least, man, let me show y'all something, man. My boy Battle Beast done, done it again, man. I gotta, I gotta give him his own segment. Listen, he done done it again, giving away the sauce. If you wanna become a better scorer, Better, he ain't helping you be a better shooter or none of that stuff right now, man. But if you want to be a better scorer, better decision maker, better passer, understand how you can get these things. I really don't want to send y'all over here because he telling y'all that the crab move is still in the game. I don't want y'all to know that. But he's telling y'all that the crab move is still in the game, how you can get better at the game. So much stuff that you can do and, and become better. Like I said, man, I got the full screen on because let me show y'all something, man. This thing is at 4,100 view. Oh, you can't see because I'm in the way. My bad. Look at the dude. The dude got the personality. He got the energy. He got everything, man. He needs, you know what I'm talking about? This thing, well, I just tell y'all, man. It's got 4,100 views and, and it's climbing. But last time, we was able to go over there and let me show y'all. Let me show y'all. Let me show y'all the power of the gym stars and the community when the community come together on something. Check it out. Bam. Look at that. Look at that. We. I, y'all listen i asked y'all i said hey can y'all help this video get to ten thousand views y'all help to get to twelve thousand. so listen we want him to keep dropping these jewels and all of this stuff man so if y'all don't do nothing else go over here video link will be down in the description man check it out bye bye 4,000 views, we try to get that thing up to at least seven thousand by the end of the day and by the time this video finishes out we want to get this joint to buy like I, at least twelve thousand, like like y'all did last time, man. So if we can do that, that would be dope. That would be awesome, and that would be the that would be the joint, man. Cause he he really he say the bag is deep. He giving you all the sauce that's in the bag. And and to end up last but not least, what y'all really came here for, man? Two K, life beyond forty, bro. Let me ask y'all a question now. A lot of y'all have all. I told y'all we're gonna segue into it. A lot of y'all have grinded this year. You really have grinded. You already was 40. Some of us was 40 within two or three weeks. I think it took me three weeks to get there, three or six weeks. Uh, some people think the grind is too short. Some think it's too long. Some people still can't even get there. I'm still seeing 10s and 20s in the park because, you know, they don't have anybody to play with. You can only really get to 40 if you're winning. 
those people don't have anybody to really play with they probably can't rock a, a, a you know 70 80 90 win percent like a lot of us can because we got a squad if you don't have that make sure you join the brute squad discord join the all city live tv discord and join the uh gym stars discord i'm gonna have the links to all of those down in the description you that's and man man grind hard i think i got his too there's no reason that you should be playing by yourself you can find somebody to play with and you can get to that level 40 but this is what i want to ask y'all for the people that reach level 40 early, what is something that 2K, this is the question of the day, what is something that 2K can give us that will keep us motivated, keep us locked in and keep us grinding? Because the, the events that just give us double rep, we, we're not gonna really play those because we already hit 40. Um, I had a couple of ideas. Maybe they can give us like special shoes or something like that. Like, you know how you get camos and stuff on Call of Duty. Maybe they can give us arm sleeve camos. They can give us different types of shoes. You keep grinding towards stuff like that. You get XP. Maybe they can just give us extra XP tokens and we can use those on the next grind or what have you like that. But I, I you know, I don't, I don't know what they could really do. But one thing I know that they could definitely do, and y'all let me know if this is something that y'all agree with. 2K wants to keep us playing. After we hit level 40, all they gotta do it say once you hit level 40, you get double VC. Hey, clap it up, man. Like, look, I, I really feel like if they did something like that, that would keep people on the game past level 40 at least a little more because I feel like once I hit level 40, I'm playing, but I'm also able to focus on content. So I like the way that they're doing it. I don't have to kill myself to do level 40. I can work my job. I can do my YouTube content. Once I drop the content, then we good to go. So if I play, I play, but I do want to be incentivized to play a little bit. So if we don't have some type of persistent rep, I feel like that if you if you don't got persistent rep and you still playing after 40, just make it be a level 40 double VC engage. I don't I, that's that's like I think the best way to do it, probably the best compromise. I don't know of anything else that they can really offer us because like I said, Call of Duty, you keep playing for camos and you keep playing for stuff. Maybe we can keep playing for the little uh, joints under my feet and stuff like that. I don't know, but I think double VC would be an awesome compromise. And there's no because since there's no legend thing in the game or no elite three or whatever where you start getting the double vc maybe we can do it every season you hit level 40 and then you get double vc from that point on until the next season starts and until you hit level 40 the next time that way the truly elite can really get something and you know well not you ain't, you ain't super elite but you know you're incentivized to keep playing the game after 40. that's just my idea man y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section what is this the question of the day and we're gonna feature the uh the next you know what the next video will feature one of some of the best ones uh in the video what is something that they can do for us so after you hit level 40 you'll continue to be incentivized to play the game y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section man we're gonna have my boy man man grind hard on tomorrow y'all seem to have loved that video or t mizzle it's gonna be one of the two it's just gonna depend on who i can get uh y'all take it easy love each and every last one of y'all go check out bear's video and i'm gonna holler at y'all next and brute video also and i'm gonna holler at y'all next time till next time it's your boy Jay Easy, aka Fresh from the Barbershop, BK the People's Champ.